Uh, here in this problem, we need to transform a Cartesian equation. So this is the given Cartesian equation into its polar equivalent. So let us begin. So since we need to convert the from the Cartesian form to the polar form, so here we are going to consider that x equals to r times cosine theta and y equals to r times sine theta. That's the relationship between the Cartesian coordinate and its polar equivalent. Then it's r and theta. X, uh, expressed in terms of r and theta, also y is expressed in terms of r and theta. Now, what we'll do, we'll consider our equation. We have x cubed plus xy squared minus 2ay squared equals to 0. So this is the Cartesian equation. Now, in order to convert it to its polar equivalent, we'll replace the value of x with r cosine theta. So we get r cubed cosine cubed theta. Then we have x times y squared. So x will be replaced with r cosine theta. And y will be replaced with r sine theta. So since we have to square r and y, uh, then we'll get r squared sine squared theta. Minus 2a times y squared. So y squared will be r squared sine squared theta. So this becomes equals to 0. Now we get r cubed times cosine cubed theta plus r times r squared is going to give us r cubed. So we have r cubed times cosine theta times sine squared theta minus 2a times r squared times sine squared theta equals to 0. Let's further simplify. Considering the first and the second term, here we can take r cubed as the common factor. We can also take our cosine theta as the common factor. So this will get multiplied to cosine squared theta plus sine squared theta and minus 2a r squared times sine squared theta equals to 0. Now, cosine squared theta plus sine squared theta, that's a standard trig identity with the value equals to 1. So we get r cubed times cosine theta minus 2a r squared times sine squared theta. Now, we can see that we can factor out r squared from both of them. And this finally is going to give us r times cosine theta equals to 2a sine squared theta. So this is going to be the polar equation or the polar equivalent of the given Cartesian equation.